brief context before we, we start showing this is uh, the drive leg, back leg, is our gas pedal, okay? That's what's gonna drive the car, and you're the car. It's our motor. Lead leg, to me, is brake pedal, right? And there's some mechanisms you can do within your lead leg mechanics before your actual lead leg block that can influence a more optimal drive leg. And we'll dive into that as well. An opportunity for the lead leg to be used as more of like a counterbalance mechanism to help load the drive leg, absorb force, produce force, and then store. So, um, you know, how a counterbalance works is, is like if I'm going into a pistol squat, I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna put my arms out and my other leg I'm gonna put out to then counterbalance the weight shift going back. And that's kind of the same terminology I would use uh, for like loading your drive leg, hip hinging, holding on to your hinge, whatever you wanna call it. Uh, but you can see as your lead leg descends, it descends and tries to gain ground going towards the target which is going to then somewhat pull your drive leg uh, and your rear hip into early internal rotation. And that's going to throw off alignment as you come into your lead leg block mechanics. So you can see as your front foot now is going to anchor into the ground, you do a good job of like everything else, dude. Like I should have prefaced by saying that, like you move really well. Um, a lot of things are, 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 are uh, you know, pretty dang good, but I'm just seeing this like little freaking thing here that I think could 100% give you more power output because now, uh, again, I said the, the, the mention of the drive leg and, and holding on to and, and storing force. And now as your lead leg comes into block, like I said, I think with that aggressive lead leg early, it's going to be um, throwing your body and your timing positioning alignment off because again, we're going to anchor down and you can see now as hip rotation is going to essentially get completed, which is going to pull your trunk through, you're going to see that the knee just a little bit is going to bow outward, like right there, right there. It's going to bow out. And this is what I would call like not clearing the hips. You can see even the direction of your front foot is a little compensated. Again, this is, a, I believe, a byproduct of kind of the lead leg mechanics being aggressive early in this delivery. Words are fun. Er, being aggressive early in the delivery. And then your knee's going to bow out. And what that is, is, is not clearing the hips. Basically, in order to truly optimize the kinetic energy um, that's being blocked by the lead leg, we need to make sure that our hips and pelvis are put into the most optimal position upon anchoring down, upon landing, to have all of that energy available up to the chain. So if our knee bows out, that's, that's what I would just kind of determine as a leakage of energy. Um, you can see this is kind of that counterbalance mechanism I was talking about, like as he goes into his load, right? So as he sinks his hips in and enters his drive phase, as he loads his drive leg and produces drive leg force, that's when his lead leg serves as that counterbalance along with his glove side, right? So he's getting into the most optimal loading phase um, when we look at like drive leg loading packages like that's going to be that biggest emphasis is like how long can we maintain hip hinge and then basically how long can we you know stay connected to the ground all right dudes robbie Rowe here thank you for watching that video if you're interested in booking your own mechanical analysis you can click that link right there also tell you a little bit about the service and what it entails hit that link right there subscribe please you can also check out that video right there which is related to the video that you just watched if you want to get some more context on that all right, guys. Much love. God bless. Till next time. See ya. Strike three. You're out.